Don't go back down. Stop the witch hunt. And here now. We won't back down. I'm a DePaul student as well, and I'm a fan of Finkelstein. But I think that at the simplest level, this is yeah. about, as a student, we should be able to learn what we want to learn. Yeah, I read about and it. we're essentially, this is an academic voice that's being silenced. I think the whole the situation is ridiculous. Um, I don't want professors on my campus scared to publish things because they might be controversial. Um, I think if you're going to try to tell the truth, you should be, you should be supported, not um, oppressed by an administration. All, all this process of voting for the tenure, uh, for the tenure is really a charade because the uh, ultimate power here is the president. The, everything else is the advisory. So it's like a dictatorial system. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, would it be too much to face the cameras here? We can hear you, but we have to see you. you, you Let me move a little further back here. Okay? No, no. 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 step all the way back. Folks, Norman, why do you stand on the Step all the way back, back. or up here. I don't, I don't expect the actual question. <laughs> During my six year stint at the pool, I consistently received among the highest student evaluations in my department. I have published five books to critical acclaim from leading scholars, and they have been translated into 46 foreign editions. I have been recognized as a public intellectual at many of the leading universities in the United States and Europe, and have become an internationally recognized scholar in my academic specialties. Based on this record, I should have received tenure. It, yes. it is now time for me to move on and hopefully find new ways to fulfill my own mission in life of making the world a slightly better place on leaving it than when I entered it. This is the Paul University statement. Today we have reached a resolution of our dispute with Professor Finkelstein. As a part of that resolution, he has agreed to resign effective immediately. Professor Finkelstein is a prolific scholar and an outstanding teacher. The university thanks him. Too good for DePaul. Not true. The university thanks him for his contributions and his service. Both parties are satisfied with the resolution of their dispute and wish each other well in their future endeavors. There is still one piece of outstanding, unfinished business, and that is the case of Professor Maureen Larudi. Everybody knows. Everybody knows it's not even a matter of serious dispute among rational people that the denial of tenure to Maureen LaRudy was political and it was a grotesque injustice. Not only as a general principle, but like myself, Professor LaRudy is on the older side of the tenure track and to throw a woman, a professor, a scholar, and a genuinely decent human being, to throw her out into the street at this point in her life and her career is simply unacceptable.